Good morning, you lovely, lovely people of the internet. If you don't know who I am, I'm Sam K. And um, yeah, we are back at work after a little while off. Again, only for today, if we're lucky. Oh, Christ. Okay. Oh, this truck has just had a new clutch and a new gearbox. Again, this will be its third gearbox. Um, and yeah, it's a bit shaky. <laughs> But yeah, I hope you're all alright. Um, bit of a good day today. We're off on our way up to Bedford, up to a farm. Then, um, then we're off to Blooming St. Neots, do a collection. Then back down to Colnebrook, do a collection there. And then, um, and then drop all that off. Well, we've just collected this lot. And um, yeah, and then go home. Um, as you can see, no one night out here. Uh, yeah, it's nice to be, nice to be back in the groove. Yeah. But I'm, I'm very much out of the groove actually. I went to bed at 11 o'clock last night. Uh, didn't need to wake up till 5. In fact, that even that was a bit early. But yeah, woke up at 3 o'clock and couldn't get back to sleep. So I ended up leaving my flat at half past 4. So yeah, very much out of the groove today. Definitely have a feeling it later. So, coffee is more of a prescription than it is a not necessary thing, words. <laughs> but yeah, I was hoping that we might catch Scott Andrews today because he is on the N25 and I'm heading towards the N25, but it looks like he's stopping in Clackett Lane. So, yeah. Oh well. Oh yeah, so what are you guys been up to? Any of you lads been furloughed or anything like that, old lads and ladies? Speaking of ladies, congratulations Laura on um, winning your hoodie. I hope you like it. And yeah, and again, sorry about the delay on the giveaway. My, my sincerest apologies. I will probably do another one again, it was really enjoyable. Um, it was nice talking to all of you and a lot of you were messaging me on Instagram and stuff like that and it was very really nice to um, get a note for you. But if you have a fancy a chat, just let me know. Oh, whoa there, Nelly. Oh, yeah, got a little bit of a journey ahead of us. How long, how long is it going to be? 80 miles. It's not too bad. So, yeah. Just get a crack up and do this. I will catch up with you guys in a little while. Concludes our business um, in this lovely part of the world. Shepherd, that's it. Yeah. Very flat around here and very windy. And it is now 25 and a half degrees. Oh, three massive crates. My god, the, the axle like lift the the air lifted by a good five inches. <laughs> oh we've got those bad boys taken off. So they're a bit heavy. It's nice round here. The sat now currently reckons we're in the middle of a field though, so that's quite funny. 
in fact, even better, so I've come out of here before um, with the sat nav on to go somewhere else. Not the same place we're going now. And as soon as I got out to the main road, it took half an hour of the arrival time, which is insane. Oh, the gearbox is so much quieter. Although, because it's got a new clutch, it's, um, it's still bedding in, so it's still very jerky. Like that. Uh, you know what, as long as go, this one's not too bad. Ah, this is the reason why I left the camera on. I don't know how good the exposure is on the front one there, but look at all those bluebells. I think they're called bluebells. Somebody can tell me in the comments. But yeah. Ain't they cool? Ah, uh, these, these are days that I love my job. Oh, that's why I forgot to put it in the front. Oh, I was just I, I usually tuck the straps back on themselves to tidy them up a little bit because they're quite long on the curtain. Um, and I've left I've left one of them. Loose. Well, it's cut and strapped, but I've just left the, the tail end bit out, which is annoying, but I'll deal with it for a bit. There we go. Yep, it's taken 15 minutes off the arrival time now to realise where I am. Ah, <laughs> oh dear. But yeah, the next place we're going to now, um, I mean, it's only 20 minutes away, but, um, but yeah, it's, it can be really awkward to get into. Because people park their cars in stupid places. All that bad. Come on, girl. Come on, girl. And we're off. Yeah, people park their cars in stupid places. So, yeah, so sometimes you've actually go in, see the industrial estate, turn yourself around, and then reverse off on your near side. Um, which is fine, because obviously it's just a region, you don't have to worry about you doing a blind size or anything like that, but it can still make life a little bit awkward. But yeah, hopefully, hopefully, no cars are parked on a stupid place. But I'll see you over there. Right, I need that. I've noticed every time I start to speak to the camera, I always check the mirror for some reason. I'll be back. Hopefully, there'll be no fun and games. Really, I would love to um, be able to. Yeah, it is, yeah. So, yeah, I'll usually, um, I would like to show you sort of like the reverse in its entirety, but. A um, bit sensitive this place, so gotta be good. There it is. Yep, car parked right there. Although, yeah, it could be a bit awkward getting out. Oh no, no. <sighs> Have the window down and wait for the punches. Samuel. I'm so close to it, it's unreal. As close as I dare. I mean, now I'm actually reversing towards the building. Basically, don't be a. Um, take a shun. That'll do, donkey. That'll do. Bit on, bit off, bit on, bit off. Hey. That will do nicely. Right. This is the first of two connections. It's only been 20 minutes away, so we'll be doing alright. We'll be doing alright. Ah! Huh. 
Ah, oh, right, that concludes our business there. Uh, who wanted to put 10 pallets on me? I was like, uh, no can do, mate. I've been told four and I've still got another six pallets to collect. So... <laughs> but yeah, when we were home collecting from next, is only, it's all like, basic pack of wet side game. Which is decent. Come on, aircon, kick in. Oh, that's a, that is a suitable amount of weight, that is. Yes. Um, but yeah, just been speaking to Dazzo, I don't know. Uh, and uh, yeah, he's been having a bit of trouble today. Go ask him. <laughs> well, yeah, just going to be tomorrow, the um, 23rd, we're we'll going to be uh, me, Truck and Wheel, and Dazzo do our little, um, well, not little, I'm sure we'll go on for a long time, um, uh, live show on YouTube, so go check out his channel, we'll be on there, I believe it's at 8 o'clock on the 23rd. Um, hopefully this video should be coming out tomorrow afternoon, which is the 23rd. Uh, if not, then go back and watch it, because it might come out Sunday, I haven't decided yet. Um, got a lot of editing to do, because I'm doing editing for uh, my girlfriend's boss as well, so... Busy boy, busy boy! Oh dear. You know, I was going around this roundabout earlier, I was in completely the wrong lane. Which is annoying. Yeah, no word if I'm back full time yet. Certainly blooming hope so. So I think I mentioned I live in a uh, one bedroom first floor flat with my girlfriend. And as you can imagine, it's starting to get a bit claustrophobic and the weather's been lovely and we can't do anything about it. Oh, come on, Dale. Come on. I think Gearbox certainly hasn't made you any faster. So, yeah. I know where I'm going, sat now. Yeah. 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 Uh, what am I making cow noises? Passed some lovely sheep earlier. Mm. All I could think about was a bit of mint sauce. Oh, you want to see that one? Oh, uh, yeah, that makes perfect sense. Fair enough. Fair enough, Santa. Yep. Yeah. I'm hearing you loud and clear. Fair enough. Dip, dip, dump, dump. I will obey you for now. Alright. I'm off to Colmore now. So, I don't know what that is. That's near Heathrow. So yes, I shall uh, update the recording there. Au revoir. Sort of like a little time lapse you might have seen if I can, if I do it. <laughs> um, I went to the wrong part of the industrial estate 
um, and just none of it made sense. So I was a bit flummoxed, to say the least. Um, but yeah, finally got the opposite paddles on. All we got to do now is head half hour of that um, back down to Cambly, tip this lot back to the yard, and we're all hunky dory and ready to go home. Might get the truck and watch that seems it's looking a bit buggy. Um, and yeah, have a little chin wag with the lads, see how they've all been. Um, I suspect I'm because, I mean this will be my boss doing me a favour to be fair, I suspect I'll be one of the last people to be taken off furlough properly. Um, so yeah, it's, um, it's going to be an interesting few months. He's only doing it this way because of the distance I live away from the yard. So I'm always the last one to be called in. Which makes sense, you know, he, 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 he's doing me a favour. Obviously, I'd like to be back full time, but I can see what he's trying to do. Um, so, yeah, no, fair play. Fair play, that man. But yeah, I'm not going to lie to you guys. Whoa, blimey neck. Bumpy, bumpy, bumpy. I'm not going to lie to you guys. You're probably going to laugh at me. I haven't exactly done a strenuous day's work, but I am knackered. <laughs> Absolutely cream crackered. Obviously, I'm just completely and utterly out of practice now. Like, this would just be a nothing day. Like, you know, this is just normal. In fact, this has actually been easier than average day because I've had to go into London. But yeah, for some known reason, I am struggling. Plus, the A1 does take it out of you. You've got to keep an eye on the speed limits and it's a bit windy in some places. It's just so badly looked after. But, um, but yeah, it does take, don't have to take it out of you. Oh dear. The M25, the six lane section. I'll never forget when this place was being, when they were sending the M25 M4 junction into six lanes. I remember the amount of chaos he used to cause my dad and when he used to come back with him off half term on the way back from Dover. He, um, yeah, it was it was never pleasant, but my mind was blown when they finished it. I'd never seen a motorway that big. <laughs> um, and then I went, I drove in Holland a few times last year and oh my God, all their motorways are that big. <laughs> Especially the ones all around Amsterdam all over the bleeding place so yeah fair play in the Netherlands fair play although to be fair they're probably so high yeah. oh yes and it's this day it's nice oh yeah um, I know a few, few of you have been asking me um, you know to talk about where I'm from and stuff like that and I'm going to do that in a second video you know, how, where I come from, what was I doing before, stuff like that. You know, get to know me a bit better. Um, yeah, well, know me with a bit reason. Oh, bloody hell. Got caught by a bit of wind. Um, yeah, a bit reason. Uh, but I will do that in a separate video. But talking of videos, go check out Truck Around Me. He um, releases the video every Saturday at 10 a.m. And he does it as a premiere. So he always has a little chat with his um, with the people who watch it. Um, it's actually become a sort of like staple part of my Saturday morning sitting there with my toast and a cup of tea and my dressing gown watching it. I'm sure you love that image Andy. And, um, and whilst we're on that subject, check out um, Trucker Wheel, it's a high herb life. Um, I just he recently put out a video um, with coronavirus um, sort of interviews. And yeah, um, Andy's in it, I'm in it, he's done one with his family. So yeah, go check him out. Uh, both their links are in the description. Um, so yeah, no, seriously, go, go have a gander. Go have a goosey gander. Uh, I'm loving it. I, I, you know what? I'm really hoping no one else goes back to it. Because I'm just loving the fact that I don't have to worry about the M25 at the moment. I can just go, 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 go. 
Anyway, let's go get this lot ticked. Ooh, the Italian's here. Ready to take what I've just given. Uh, so, we are tipped and done. Did you recognise this place from everybody this morning? So yeah, just a pretty standard normal day today, nothing special. Uh, I do apologise, it probably hasn't been the most entertaining. Um, I have been knackered all day. Um, as I said earlier, I didn't get much sleep last night. And uh, yeah, I've been uh, sort of struggling all day. Uh, but I want to vlog because I want to keep you guys up to date. Um, but yeah, so, uh, congratulations Laura. And uh, yeah, go check out Trucker Randy and Trucker Will. I shall see you guys when I'm next to work. Because I'm just going to keep trying to vlog whenever I'm at work now. Because that seems rarer anyway. I used to vlog once a week and now I'm working once a week, so it kind of makes sense. But yeah, I shall speak to you later. Ta-ta! Bye! Yeah.